Okay, boys and girls, we are going to work on this handwriting worksheet now. On one side of it, this side, we're going to work on your capital, your uppercase C's. And on the other side, we are going to work on your lowercase C's. So, let's look at this now. Our C is just what? What did we say yesterday? Our C is just a big curve. So, we start right here, and we trace our big curve around from the ceiling to the floor. We start, remember, we always begin at the top, and we work our way down. So, we're not going to begin down here and go up. That would be backwards. We always begin at the top, and we're just making a big curve around. Begin at the top, and make a big curve around. So as you can see here, I finished tracing both rows of my uppercase capital C's. So go ahead and pause the video until you get your C's traced. And then go ahead and you can resume it and then we'll go ahead and do the bottom part of the page. Now here on the bottom, it does not give us the C to trace, and so we need to make it ourselves. But they do give us a dot. Now remember, the C comes this way from the dot. It doesn't go the other way. So we're going to start on our dot, and we're going to make a big curve around from the ceiling to the floor. Now when we start on this dot, and we make our big curve, we can't go clear over into this little space. We have to stay, keep the letter in its own space. So we start at this dot, and we make a big curve around from the ceiling to the floor. Start at this dot, make a big curve around from the ceiling to the floor. So go ahead and finish making these uppercase capital C's, and then pause the video, and then when you are finished with your C's, you can resume the video, and we will talk about the bottom. What is this a picture of here at the bottom? It is a picture of corn that we eat in the summertime, and that is what this word is. It starts with that C, that K sound, corn, and it ends with that N sound, the N we had last week. So go ahead and trace this. Now remember, we always start at the top and work our way down. There is our uppercase C. This is our letter O. We're going to be talking about it next week or the week after Thanksgiving. Here's our all. We start at the door knob, you drop down, swim up and over. And then here's our in. Start at the door knob, dive down, swim up and over and down. And then you can go ahead and call all your picture of the corn. Go ahead and call all that. Pause the video, because I'm going to begin the back, and I don't want to get ahead of you. This is the back of your handwriting page for today. And on it, we are doing your lowercase c. And your lowercase c is made very much the same way as your uppercase c, except it is smaller. So instead of starting at the ceiling, it begins at the doorknob. So you put your pencil right below the doorknob, and you're going to trace just a little curve around. And make sure it touches the floor, but it doesn't go through the floor. Remember, we call this our magic C, because our magic C is the beginning of a lot of our letters. 
Remember our lowercase a began with our magic C. So we're just tracing a little curve around from the dull knob to the floor. Go ahead and pause the video until you get the first two rows traced like I did. And then you can resume it and we can go down to the next section. Here in this next section, we are going to do our lowercase c's more, but they did not give us anything to trace. They only gave us a dot on which to put our pencil to begin. So begin by putting your pencil on the dot and making a little curve that goes up to the doorknob and down to the floor. Put your pencil on the door and make a little curve up to the door knob and down to the floor. And try to make it nice and round. We don't want it jagged. Put your pencil on the dot, go up to the door knob and down to the floor. It's just a little curve around for our magic C. Pause the video until you get this much finished, and then we can go on. What is this a picture of? This is a picture of a cat. C-c-cat. Do you hear that c sound? That is this little C at the beginning of, the, of cat making that sound. And we have learned all of these letters, so we can sound it out. Cat, cat, cat. So let's go ahead and trace cat. Remember, for our C, we start right below the door knob and we make a little curve from the door knob to the floor. For our A, we're going to make that same magic C. See, right now it's the magic C. But instead of picking your pencil up, you're going to keep helicopter up, bump, down, bump. And then for our T, we make a big line down and we cross it at the center. And we usually make our T clear up at the top like that. And now, you, once the video ends, you may color your picture of the cat and you may color your picture of the car. Thank you so much for doing your handwriting with me today, boys and girls. Have a great day.